Alicia, and I run a travel blog called My Life Untethered. I probably travel about once a month, so travel is really uh, something that I try to inspire other people to do as well through my blog. I've learned a lot of really great packing tips and travel tips, and I'm going to share them with you so that you can use them on your travels. Choosing the right luggage is key. You have to decide based on your destination, based on the activities you're going to be doing. I try and travel as often as I can with just my carry-on. Having a smartphone is hands down one of the best tools that you can bring with you on your travels. It acts as your GPS, it can be your currency converter, music player, camera. It's unreal the things that you can do with a smartphone now. Another thing I like to do to save money is buying an all-in-one adapter, which can be used in any country, and a headlamp. And that's great for reading at night, if you need to go to the washroom, a headlamp can really save you. All right, I like to do the rule of twos when it comes to packing with clothing. Aside from underwear and socks, you don't need more than two of anything. And definitely stay away from the whites. One thing I love to do to save space is I like to roll my clothes and I also like to use bags to help organize different items for different days and uses. When it comes to toiletries, I like to actually buy little dollar store refillable bottles. You can put your shampoos, conditioners in them and save a lot of money that way. A really important thing to do, which not many people think about before they travel, is to document your documentation. Taking a picture of my passport, just so that I have copies of it both in digital format and in physical hard copy. So planning is the ultimate key before you travel. My top six travel tips are choosing your luggage wisely. Smartphones can really be the all-in-one travel tool. Follow the tool item rule and leave white behind. Roll, bag, and save some space. Less is more for toiletries. And document your documentation. So now that you have my travel tips, it's time for you to get out there and experience the world for yourself.